iPhone frequently restart is a very common issue, which is very annoying in normal phone use. In 12 minutes, this iPhone XS Max restarted three times. How can this type of failure be repaired? Let us see it together. Notice, the restart log of iPhone is an important way to check the iPhone restart failure. Click in order, home page, setting page, privacy page, analytics and improvements page, analytics data page, then query panic full file, and click to open the recent, panic full file. Query all data codes after, panic string in data page. According to analysis, we can determine that the fault code is, user space watchdog timeout, and the corresponding faulty component is charging dock flex and other parts. From this, we conclude that charging dock flex is most likely to fail, so we will replace it. This is the new original charging dock flex. Next step tear down all related internal parts to remove charging dock flex. If you are familiar with the disassembly process, you can click to jump to 2 minute 35 seconds. Remove original charging dock flex. Then replace new charging dock flex. Finally, reinstall other internal parts and mainboard, restore the iPhone. If you are not interested in this operation, you can skip to 4 minutes 7 seconds. Now that the new charging dock flex has been installed, we restart the iPhone XS Max to test various functions. Start the phone timer, record the time change, and check to see if the issue of repeated restarts has been resolved. After 12 minutes, iPhone keep working well, which indicating that the restart problem has been successfully resolved. The fault component troubleshoot chart is shown below. To get a complete version file, please contact electworldservice at gmail.com. Have you learned how to use restart log to troubleshoot and repair failures? Welcome to subscribe to our channel to get easy to learn repair knowledge and skills.